What's up guys? Jake here. Um, we are packing currently, trying to. Um, it is Monday, April 2nd, about 10 o'clock in the morning. I have to pack right now, get everything ready. I go into work, get off work at midnight, throw my stuff in the ice castle, and then we drive eight hours up north to Lake of the Woods. Stop at the Senex Aurora. We'll uh, we just made it to War Road. We are at the landing. Uh, Mark is trying to check it out, trying to figure out which way we're gonna go. Um, it is cold up here. We are literally on the border of Canada and Minnesota. Um, sun's out though, so my fingers are cold. Um, but I'm, I'm excited. We're gonna get on some fish. Uh, we'll probably be fishing um, late af later afternoon or early afternoon. I mean, so uh, yeah, let's let's get on the ice, eh? So we are on, we are officially on the ice. I'm not gonna lie, every time we drive on the ice, I get a little nervous. Uh, so, those of you from the south watching, we have our windows down, just, just in the small chance the ice breaks and we go through, we can get out. Uh, keep our seatbelts off. So we are heading out to, how deep we're going? Oh, 18. 18 feet, I guess. It's this long, comfortable ride out to our spot. So this is uh, this is where we're gonna be staying the night. This beautiful hotel that we actually have TV in this thing. We get TV out here on the ice, ice fishing. That's ridiculous. This isn't ice fishing. This is freaking. A hotel on the ice. <laughs> So to all my friends that were freaking out about going through the ice, we got four feet of ice up here. We got a goddamn train across. Drive a, he says we could drive a train across. Okay, so we're checking for depth. We're trying to get on the right spot here. And then uh, hopefully we can get set up and start fishing here soon. So, so right now what we're doing is uh, scooping out the, the, the snow and the slush out of the holes here, cleaning them out. Let me check this out. I got a full bucket and I'm not even I'm not even done scooping out that hole so it was about 3 30 in the morning uh, I was trying to do an update and it is now four I was trying to do an update and literally as I was saying how we were not catching fish um, the rattle wheel went off um, and ended up missing that one, but then as soon as I re-rigged and dropped it back down the hole, we caught three back to back. One we had to throw back because it was just too small, but uh, now we're just kind of sitting and seeing if we'll get any more. This time I'll make sure the mic is on. <laughs> I'm trying to do a video and you're barking. Uh, so right now, you say we're moving about a half mile out? Yeah. We're moving a half mile out, farther, onto the lake. So, we're in search of the fish. Has he got it down pretty far? Halfway so, down, halfway down. Still pulling it out? Uh, he's mo it's moving. It's coming back up slowly. Is that the hook? I got it, I got it. Oh, dude, dude. Got a fish here, too. Small one. You got a fish here. Oh, he's let him go. Yep. 
You almost pulled your pole in. <laughs> I, don't know, if, pole in. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that. Maybe that's on camera, actually. Yeah, that would be in camera. That'd be sweet. Uh, so, I don't know if you can tell. I got a little excited and pulled the whole reel off the thing. I'm going to pull this up, check the minnow. That would have been funny. Get a double whammer right there. And I tangled it. This is what we're using right here. This is the color that they're hitting on. A little minnow head. I'm going to drop that back down right away because when they're hot, they're hot, I guess. Huh? Okay. Oh my gosh, I was laying uh, I was laying on the couch on the bed here and I looked at the Vexlar and there was a mark and oh my gosh, I'm <laughs> shaking. Oh, look at this thing. <laughs> oh, look at that. That that is what we were after right here. This is the Lake of the Woods walleye. Oh, oh my gosh, Mark, that was awesome. Okay. Okay. That's a Walleye. 23 inches. <laughs> What's the slot? That's a slot. Walleye. So I have to throw it back? I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah! I'm serious. How big was That's it? Why I come up here. How big was it? 20, 23. <laughs> yeah, just, and I wasn't even doing that. I was laying here. I just looked, and there's a big mark where my bait was, and I was like, what? And uh, as soon as I pulled up, he, he took off. How'd you hook it? <clears throat> All right, so, oh my gosh. So, so I was laying down on the couch. I was laying down and I looked down and I saw where my bait is supposed to be, a really thick red mark. And so I picked up the pole and as soon as I picked it up, it was there and I set the hook. Um, and I laid into this 23 inch walleye. I mean, we, we tightened up the drag quite a bit and it took, the drag just was buzzing. And so, I mean, immediately I knew it was big.